Hi all the signs of the zodiac, I'm Brenda and I'm here today to bring you your daily tar angel tarot and oracle message for October 28, 2018. I want to thank you for your interest in my channel and for viewing, liking, sharing and subscribing to them and all the beautiful messages that you leave me behind after you've seen these videos. I truly feel blessed and I thank you for that. This is a general daily reading and it's short and to the point and you know that it's general and if you need any clarity uh, or answers to any questions and accuracy you can go to my website and click on there and I will get back to you as soon as I can to set up a private reading with you. Now today we start off with a water card and water cards are relationship cards whether they're intimate or they are not intimate. They can be strictly a friendship uh, relationship and it is the Queen of Cups in regular tarot. So this Queen of Water, she's very thoughtful, she's very kind, she's very tender hearted, she's patient and she's loving. And it could also refer to a woman that you may know right now who is a Pisces, a Scorpio or a Cancer, a water sign. She may be around you, this woman, and you may be having uh, to uh, uh, share some uh, energy and uh, information with this woman. I do see that if any of you are in a relationship with an individual <clears throat> right now or a partner or other people, because this is a relationship card dealing with people around us in our lives, that uh, this relationship is going to develop to a new level and it's all about the fact that you've been thinking about uh, this person in a kinder, more understanding manner. And also you, you're taking care of yourself here and you know it's, it's the do unto others thing here. When it comes to this card I always think that and it's how you, you want to be treated and that's how you're going to transcend that to them. And this is what's bringing this relationship into a new level, okay? And it's trusting, it's trusting each other and trusting your own intuition with this uh, individual. But it could have to do with someone that you're going to be dealing with who is this queen of water. So it could be a water sign like I was saying. Now, moving on to the middle card, you've been given an amazing uh, major card here, and it is the world, and the world is all about full circle completion. Something that you've been working on, perhaps, uh, it is now coming into completion, and it's 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 successful. You've done a great job with it. Um, it's all about you now being able to reap in the benefits and the abundance of that in, in the form of joy and contentment and gratitude. So please know that you are on the right path, you're going in the right direction and things are going to be working out. This is a beautiful, beautiful card. Now, the next card you got is strength and strength is all about dealing with any challenges, people, anything in your life right now, situations, circumstances, the energy around you or people in your life as I was saying. And this is about digging deep for inner strength, okay? It's about being gentle, you know, I mean the picture here, the graphics here, here you are dealing with it but this is a lion. And the lion is docile, the lion is content, the lion is calm. And that's what you have to do when you're dealing with any challenges or anybody, because this is a relationship card, you're dealing with people today, do it in a kinder, more understanding manner. Um, I, I want you to release any ill feelings, any animosity, any, uh, any harsh judgments that you may be harboring when you're dealing with these individuals because you know, you're going to get more with honey than you are with vinegar as they say the old adage. So this is all about being strong but, but you know, stand, stand up for your convictions, stand up for your own rights, be determined about what it is you have to do when you're communicating with them but don't do it aggressively, okay? Don't say things that you can't take back, okay? <coughs> Excuse me. Now, if you can do that and both of these cards, the beginning and the end of this reading, <coughs> excuse me, I'm very sorry, it was dry in here and I didn't bring my water. You, you'll end up with this world card, you'll end up, this will come to fruition, things will work out when you're communicating with these individuals today and it's all going to work out in your favor. Now your oracle message, beautiful card from the Healing with the Angels deck is balance and balance is all about doing things in moderation. <coughs> excuse me, not jumping in with both feet into that quicksand and then trying to figure out how you're going to swim your way out of this situation. It's all about, uh, you know, it's all about compromise, it's all about, uh, you know, uh, doing things in moderation basically so that things work out for in your favor here. Don't jump in with both feet, um, know that you have to look at the situation, it's, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> I'm so sorry. This is what balance is all about, doing things in moderation. There may be compromise here, okay? This is about cooperation here with these individuals that you're going to be dealing with today. 
So there may be compromises, but at the end of the day, you're going. it's going to work out. It's going to work out. So I wish you a great remainder to today, and I'll see you again tomorrow. And I stand in that circle of light for you, my friends.